Hello guys, Sanjay here and welcome to Daily Tech Bites with Dhananjay episode number 14 where we are going to discuss about tech news which are going around in the world that too in matter of 5 minutes and if you have not subscribed to the channel already then do hit that subscribe button down below because many more awesome videos like these are going to come on daily basis and if you are still watching this video then you are great because I am going to give away these La Eco Bluetooth headphones in this video and make sure you stay tuned till the end of this video to know the rules to enter into the giveaway of this headphone and this giveaway is just because we completed 14 daily tech bites and uh, it's amazing that you guys are still watching it and you are enjoying it if you have any type of feedback if you like it if you don't like it what do you want me to improve or you just want me to do it the way I'm doing it right now let me know about that in the comments below so let's get started with our first news and there have been multiple leaks about Samsung Galaxy A3 and A7 2017 edition not 2016 because 2016 edition is already launched. Samsung Galaxy A7 2017 will come with 1.8 GHz octa-core processor, 3 GB of RAM, 32 GB of internal storage, 5.5 inch 1080p display and Android version 6.0.1. And if Samsung is going to launch these phones after 6 months maybe then I expect them to launch these phones with Android and most probably even though it says Android 6.0.1 over here it might be testing of those devices who knows and the Samsung Galaxy A3 2017 will have a 4.7 inch 720p screen not only this but the octa-core 1.5 GHz processor 2 GB of RAM and 8 GB of internal storage and I expect the cameras on A7 and A3 to be excellent because I have used J7 2016 which is priced at 15,000 Indian rupees and it performs exceptionally well when it comes to camera department. It is far better as compared to Lino K5 Note or even the Redmi Note 3. Redmi Note 3 is nowhere near J7 2016. And the next news is about 4G devices and thanks to Geo for that or thanks to Life Phones for that. So in Q1 2016, we sold around 15.4 million units, but in Q2 2016, we sold 18.2 million devices and Life has sold 15 lakh phones. If you do not know about Life, Life is a phone with which you get a Geo SIM card free and few months back you had to buy a Life phone in order to get the Geo SIM card and that's why Life was able to sell 15 lakh smartphones because the Life phones are really bad. I don't think so that I can recommend anyone to buy a Life phone other than for the geo offer that they have to offer. Not only 15 lakh phones, but it was worth 700 crores. Uh, that's an estimated price basically, but around 700 crores. That's a huge number in my opinion. And the next news is about Samsung devices or to be precise, Exynos processors. And currently, Samsung uses ARM technology to make its GPU. So as you saw in the A7 2017, the GPU was ARM Mali T830. That means it uses ARM technology, but Samsung is trying to move from ARM to NVIDIA or AMD for its GPU technology, which can be a good step too in my opinion. Uh, we do not know because processor with those technologies have not launched yet. And these are just leaks as of now. Nothing is confirmed yet. And there was a news on Indian Express website that said Facebook is testing new Twitter-like feature for news feed. On Twitter, if you engage with my tweets, then my tweets will be shown at the top as soon as you open the Twitter application. So let's assume I tweeted something yesterday saying, you guys are great and you replied to me saying, yeah, you are great too. Uh, uh, anyways, yeah, you, you replied that. So next day when you open Twitter application, you will see my tweet first because you engaged with my tweet and you are getting engaged with my tweet. And that's how it will work on Facebook too. But frankly speaking, I see the exact same thing on Facebook too. Like people with whom I engage, those people's posts are shown at the top. So I do not understand what this article wanted to say, but they said that it will have a separate section named as what friends are talking about and that will show all the posts which are made by your friends. So yeah, this is pretty much it for the daily tech news of episode 14 and I'm going to keep the same exact tech deal that I showed you guys yesterday and it's about Anchor Power Bank. This power bank is really good and Anchor is not paying me anything. I just want you guys to buy a very good product. That's why I have kept the same deal for today too because yesterday in my live show, many people were asking me about power bank. So if you guys are watching today, then buy Anchor Power Bank if you haven't already. And now let's talk about the giveaway of this awesome Bluetooth headphones. So in order to enter into this giveaway, you just need to do three steps. First, like this video. Second, subscribe to the channel. And if you have already subscribed to the channel, then no need to unsubscribe and doesn't subscribe back. If you have already subscribed, that's great. And the third step is that you have to comment down below and you can comment anything or you can give me suggestions or feedback on Daily Tech Bites whether you like it or not like it as I said earlier in the video. So yeah, this is pretty much it for the Daily Tech Bites with Dhananjay episode number 14 where we discussed about Daily Tech News and the Daily Tech Deal. So I hope you guys enter into this giveaway. So yeah, thank you guys. Thank you for watching.